Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm gonna show you how I got this really easy, pretty, smoky, shimmery eye. Step one is going to be priming the eyes and I'm using our Smooth Canvas Primer with our Pointed Blender Brush and I'm just applying it all over the lid very evenly and very lightly. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and open our Jet Setter palette and I'm going to start off by using the color Desert in the outer creases. And the brush I'm using is a Morphe Fluffy brush, which is M433. And per usual, all of the brushes and the products will be linked in the description box below. But I'm just buffing that desert color into the outer crease and bringing that color on the outer V area and creating like an almond shaped eye. So I'm just doing small circular motions starting from out, working my way in the creases. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and take a clean pointed blender, blender brush and just diffuse the edges. So I use the other brush to apply the product, this one right here, and um, after that, I'm gonna take the pointed blender brush and diffuse the edges by just buffing out in small circular motions. As you can see, I'm not doing windshield wiper motions, I'm doing small circular motions. And what this does is it really makes the eyeshadow just blend very nicely and makes the edges very nicely diffused. So there's no harsh lines. I'm just taking my time with this, not, um, blending it really nicely. Um, I am picking up some more color as I go down and bring it back up. And I'm showing right here that as I dip back into the palette, I am giving my brush a little flick. And if I'm holding two brushes in the hand, I just kind of click the two brushes together to get the excess off. Now I'm going in and applying the color Jet Lag um, with that same pointed blender brush. And I'm just applying it um, in the outer V area and then I'm working my way into the lid. So I'm applying this color all over the entire lid, but I'm applying it in layers. And I don't want to um, go over the desert color that I applied previously. I don't want to cover that up. I want those two colors to meet together and blend nicely. So I'm doing the same thing on the other eye, just packing that color on, picking up some more, tapping the excess off, and bringing it all over the lid. So, so far we've only used two colors. We've started off with desert and then we are using jet lag to intensify the color. And I'm just marrying the two colors together by buffing them in. Adding some more desert on the other side. And by flicking the eyeshadow on the outer V like this, you are creating a longer almond shaped eye. Now I'm going in with the color Jet Lag again and I'm using our detail brush and I'm just smoking out the lower lash line, which is the area right behind, right behind the eyelashes on the bottom, if that makes sense. So I'm just smoking it out, blending it back and forth. And as I'm picking up, I am tapping the excess off. And I'm just connecting the top shadow with the bottom shadow as I'm doing this. And now I'm just going back in and I'm blending the edges out again. And I'm adding some more jet lag. So just I'm just intensifying the look a little bit more by layering the colors on top of each other. Now I'm just adding in the color icon in the inner eye area. And now I'm going in with Ninja Eyeliner and I'm just winging my eyeliner out just a little bit and applying on the top lash line. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. I should have sharpened, sharpened my pencil. What's new? If you've been following me for a while, my pencils are really sharp, sharpened. But yeah, I'm just here doing my eyeliner, trying not to poke my eye because the pencil needs to be sharpened. And as you can see, I'm just trying to flick the wing out a little bit, just blending it out. Yep, it's like, I wanna make sure I don't poke my eye. 
Okay, now we're just gonna put liner on the bottom waterline. Making a funny face here. And then I'm just using a precise liner brush just to, um, you know, to cut the wing a little bit, making it a little bit more pointy and just blending it in together. And I'm listening to some music, so you see me dancing a little bit. And then I'm just applying, um, I'm using that brush on the lower lash line. I don't really have any product on there. I'm just smudging it all together. Giving my eyelashes a little curl. And I did pop on some lashes off camera. I also finished up my lipstick and my blush off camera. And then after I did all that, we are gonna apply a little touch of shimmer right at the center of the eye. And I'm using the Stella color. Stella, Stila, probably Stila. I believe, I don't know what the color is called, but it's gonna be linked down below. But I'm just applying a little bit and I'm using my fingers to blend it out. And basically I want the pop of color to be in the center and I want the edges around it to be diffused. So I'm just using my finger for that. I'm applying a little bit extra on that little area right there. And then I just went back in with my brush, my fluffy brush, and I diffused the edges out by adding a little bit of that jet lock around the colors. And that's it, that completes the look, guys. It's super easy, super quick. I only use three colors, and that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys next time.